politicians, I think, got hurt during a baseball practice just because of their political agenda. Hey guys, so today I come to you with a topic I usually don't talk about all that much in my normal videos, but I thought it's, well, about time since with the recent events in the world, especially the shootings that happened in America um, where politicians, I think, got hurt during a baseball practice just because of their political agenda by some fanatic, whatever, that extremist, supposedly was taken down by one of the politician's security detail, otherwise it would have been a total massacre, I think. Um, well, it just shows me again that this extremist behavior that I see in my own comments all the time as well, where people tell me to die or that my, my family, my, my mother, uh, someone else will get raped by refugees and shit like that. I mean, we all want the same in the end, right? I mean, the people who tell me that my family will get raped and, and shit like that, they they lashing out because, I mean, they're idiots in the first place. Otherwise, why would you tell that to, to another human being? But on the other hand, I understand that they are scared, that they think, oh no, this will happen to Germany, then will happen to the rest of the world if we're not careful, blah, blah, blah. Um, they have this, this fear inside them that makes them lash out at others, right? But why can't we all just, I mean, this will sound like some hippie bullshit and maybe a bit redundant and, and I don't know. Why can't we just all live in peace together, right? <laughs> all this them and us behavior in any situation, may it be religion, may it be politics or anything else, uh, that just leads to bullshit, that, that just leads to violence and hatred and I just understand why, why people don't see that and just fall into this pattern over and over and over. I think the media has a big part in it, obviously they do f well, they love fear mongering. I think it's gotten a bit better in the last couple of months, at least what I see from uh, German media, at least partially, not all of it is, is like, well, improved, so to speak, but a little bit. And then I hope that that is going to be a trend. Maybe they saw all the people, they, they don't want bullshit. You know, we, we want to show them the truth now because otherwise no one will read our newspapers, will watch our news shows or anything else. So I hope that's at least going to change a little bit and I really hope that the behavior of people in the comments or just in general in the world will change as well as time progresses, as time goes by. Because I really, it saddens me, like the stuff I see sometimes in my comments just makes me... I don't know, speechless, I don't know what to say about that. Like, why would you say that to another human being, right? Like, kill yourself or some other bull... Like, I don't care about that kind of stuff anymore. I just block them and then don't think about it anymore. But just sometimes I'm like, that person is seriously <laughs> fucked up. Like, what made them be that way? <laughs> why do they think it's okay to lash out at someone else like that? And you see that those words are not necessarily harmless because as you see with the shooting in America, things can happen or result from that. So I don't think you shouldn't really... I don't know. You should definitely be aware of that that might be a person that might actually do something. Um, I still, like, I can't concern myself too much with it. Like I just said, I don't care about it in, the, in a way that it affects me. I mean, I still see it and I read it and I'm like, okay. I don't want to meet that person in the streets, you know, but still, I can't let it affect me in a way that, that it disturbs my workflow or my, my daily life, because then I wouldn't be able to do this for you guys. It's just, I don't know, I, I wanted to talk about this and, and figure out maybe with you guys, together with you guys, why people are like that in the comments and, and why, like, if, if you know someone who is like that, and if you think something happened that made them be that way or if they just think the the um anonymity, anonymity uh, damn it i'm german sorry on in the internet makes them i don't know be more open about what they really think and maybe they're hiding it in real life i don't know it's just something i notice over and over and over and it it annoys me it disturbs me uh, to some degree as well that 
yeah, I'm repeating myself that people can be like that. I just think if we all came together and like actually talked instead of talking about each other, like and not on the internet where like everything is taken the wrong way anyways, then many people would actually, I don't know, see that the person behind that political agenda, behind that religion is actually just like them or similar at least and that they can find a common ground. But if you just keep on this spiral of hatred on the internet or in the news, them against us, then that will never stop. I, I don't know. And people call me, like, people from the left call me Nazi. Like, I get Nazi comments all the time. People from the right call me cuck. You can just see that people from both sides are really angry. And I see myself more in the middle, to be quite honest, because, of course, I'm against violence. Uh, when it comes to religious violence especially as well, like I don't want anyone to force their religion on anyone. I don't want that, but I also think to myself like, well, yeah, there are some people in need of help though, when we talk about refugees and stuff like that, there are honest people, hardworking people, and you need to, to, to be able to differentiate. Not all of the refugees will be terrorists or violent people. Yes, there are some among them, I don't deny that at all, like I agree but they're also good people. And I don't know, one of the sides is always just generalizing, like, oh, all of them are terrorists. No, all of them are good. No, that's not true. There's a common, like a middle ground here. There are good people and bad people, and the, the life isn't black and white. The life isn't Republican versus Democrats. The life isn't right versus left. There's many more facets to life, and I don't understand why people can't see that, where they have to be on one of the extreme sides all the freaking time. That, that's just not how freaking life works. And I, I know I'm not that old and I can't give you advice on that. I, like you probably think I can't give you advice on that, but why don't you see that then? Like if even I see that, I don't, I don't know. But I'm really rambling on right now. So I'm, I apologize about that. I just want, I don't know, maybe start a discussion with you guys to see what you have to say about all of this. Cause it really baffles me. It just really, leaves me in disbelief when I when I read about stuff happening in the world, when I read through my comments sometimes as well, the spam folder mostly, but it's just, I don't know, I know that even under this video where I clearly state that I think we should all get together and talk like normal people, I know that there will be some bullshit hate under this video as well. I expect that, 100%. I just want to understand, like maybe if you are one of those people, maybe you can explain yourself. Like if you know that you have left comments like that before, I don't like, I don't want to attack you. I don't want to shame you in public here. Maybe just explain yourself why you felt the need at that point in your life, at that point in time to comment something like that. Like I don't want to shame you. I don't want to put you down or anything like that. You don't even have to say what exactly you said, just maybe. I don't know, give us an explanation, I would really appreciate that. So guys, I hope this wasn't too much of a rant, and that wasn't too redundant. Um, probably was, but I just felt the need to talk about this. Anyways guys, um, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to get Germanized. Goodbye and auf. Wiedersehen.